of things being optionally manned. I think you're going to see a mix of three things. I think obviously the manned fighters are building today, the F-35s are going to be around for a long time. I think they will operate, uh, they will interoperate with unmanned vehicles, um, perhaps in, in these swarms where you can get leverage out of an F-35 by having four little buddies, for example, around it. And I think you'll see systems like, for example, if you go back and, and read the Gates announcement last January about the new long-range strike uh, you know, penetrating bomber and talked about it being optionally manned. So I think, I don't think that there is an, a, a, a black and white answer to that. I think it's going to be a combination of manned, unmanned, uh, and, and optionally manned platforms as, as we go forward. I think, for example, when the time comes, we'll see if we actually ever build a sixth generation fighter, if we can afford it. I would not be surprised to see the optionally manned um, options still exist. So I think the, I think the, uh, it's not yet decided, I think, but I think the combination is pretty likely. Okay, yeah. So yes.